today we are going to mainly focus on the change of state. That how is it that solid change is liquid and gas and each of them can change into the other ones. And all of these names are there for the process. So solid can change to a liquid, which can change to a gas. And the relationships are there. So what is the process of solid changing to a liquid? Hmm? Melting. melting, exactly. So you can change a solid to liquid through melting. And liquid to solid goes by, what's the process? Freezing. Freezing, exactly. So this one is freezing. Similarly, uh, liquid changes to gas through two processes. What are those two processes? Evaporation and boiling. Evaporation and boiling, absolutely. They're two different processes, even though the starting and ending states are the same. And gas can change to liquid through condensation. And lastly, solid changes to gas through a process we call, this is deposition, gas changing to a solid. And solid changing to a gas is called sublimation. And this way, it does not become a liquid. So if they ask you to define what sublimation is, you say that solid changing to gas directly without being a liquid. That is what sublimation is. Solid can change to a gas through this long process, but that's not sublimation. It is when it goes directly, that's sublimation. All ammonium salts, ammonium salts and CO2 show sublimation. So that is a fun fact that you should know. At least know it about CO2. Even if you ignore it for ammonium salts, that's fine. But you should know that CO2 always does that. Now, how exactly does this happen? What are the underlying reasons? Let's go back to this diagram. The solid is changing to a liquid and that process is melting. What's happening? The distances are increasing. The motion is more free. It goes sliding instead of vibration. And the forces are weaker. So one thing we can know for sure is that forces are being reduced. You're getting less and less forces and more and more kinetic energy. And that is the key here. It's the kinetic energy which is the key. We increase the kinetic energy and that changes it. Okay. 